I bring this back. Does there any other testimony that on SB 30? Anybody wants to speak on behalf of it? Down south? Anything for speaking for SB 30? Neutral, sir. Okay, we'll go to neutral. Jonathan Friedrich, F-R-I-E-D-R-I-C-H. My only concern is on page three, item number C. The association has established internal accounting controls which comply with generally accepted accounting principles to safeguard the assets of the association. What are those safeguards? I'd like to see that language, and I would like to quote Mr. McArthur, if he doesn't mind, to tighten this language up to safeguard it. You've got some very large associations that have huge budgets, and we've heard testimony from Monica Weiss about her management company had embezzled a large amount of money, and it's interesting to note that last week the Common Interest Community Commission held a hearing against a former board president. His name is Raymond Barr, and he embezzled either $62,000 or $72,000 within approximately a two-month period. Excuse me, Mr. Friedrich, I'm not sure that's appropriate for this forum. I just wanted to make sure. Anything you want to talk about policy, but I don't think accusing anyone of any crimes, unless they've been convicted, I don't think that's appropriate here. The point is that this generally accepted accounting principles to safeguard money, it just seems very loose, and it doesn't really specify any statute or any actual safeguard. There should be one general, I shouldn't say general, one specific statement that all associations should use rather than having a variety of different safeguards. We have nearly 3,000 homeowner associations in the state, and if we had 3,000 different safeguards, it would be maddening. Those are my only concerns on this bill. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mr. Friedrich, your concerns are primarily Section 1, if I understand it correctly. It's on, yes, Section 1, subsection 4, C like in Charles, on page 3, lines 1 to 3. It just seems very general and loose. Unfortunately, we have a lot of very dishonest people, and we have a lot of people. Do you have any recommended substitution language or anything? Unfortunately, I'm not a CPA, but if I can get something to you, I most certainly will email it up to you. Okay, well, if you would copy Mr. McArthur, Mr. Carrillo, and the Judiciary Committee Manager, Nicole Bailey, I'd appreciate that as well. Anything you send up for consideration for the subcommittee, I'd sure appreciate that. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Thank you for your time this morning. Is there anyone else who wishes to speak? Okay, we'll take a brief recess.